But here we go, boys. Don't know what's gonna happen. Bam. Oh. Bro. You guys can probably tell, you know, by the uh, the title and the thumbnail, we're gonna be crafting the actual Infinity Gauntlet and basically becoming, you know, a Minecraft Marvel superhero god. Now, guys, a lot of you were actually suggesting that I check out this mod, so I went and found it, but the suggestions came from Super Gentai AGS, Isaiah Garcia, Leslie Castillo, and Omni Animator all wanted to see me craft the Infinity Gauntlet in Minecraft. Now guys, if you do enjoy today's video and want to see some more awesome Minecraft videos, just leave a like on today's video. Also, be sure to subscribe and then tap that bell with your infinity gauntlet so you never miss out on a brand new video. And then last but not least, comment any mod you want to see down below in the comment section or anybody else that you think could go up against uh, your boy right here with his infinity gauntlet. Now we're going to be testing out against, you know, regular mortal Minecraft mobs, you know, like creepers, zombie pigmans. We also have some dinosaurs in here just because dinosaurs are super flipping cool. But yeah, guys, before we start actually getting into the Infinity Gauntlet, I wanted to show off each and every power gem. Because obviously, if you're a fan of the comics, you know that there have been people that have collected, you know, individual gems and they're super powerful. But then when you get the Infinity Gauntlet, you're basically unstoppable. So yeah, guys, let's just uh, test out first off the uh, the power gem. So if I just spawn in some creepers right here. Okay, don't blow up. Dude, why is he blow? Why are they all just blowing up on each other? What the flip? Aha, <laughs> okay, we have one creeper. Bam, take that. All right, that wasn't as impressive. I just don't, I want these guys to blow up. I don't know why. Dude, I am running away. Stop blowing up. All right, let's try this. Maybe if I, oh, oh, oh the reality gem. So I sort of know what these do, but once you combine them all together in the infinity gauntlet, they get uh, a ton more powerful. So I don't know if this, uh, can I just, I'm literally just breaking blocks by pushing this thing down. What the heck? Oh, what the? Oh, if I shift and right click, yo, I could just go into creative mode. That is amazing. And then I could just keep going down and down. Bye, Mr. Creeper. I'll see you later, dude. Guys, he's still going down. Wait, can I go all the way down to bedrock? All right, it looks like this is the lowest I can go. But if I drop down there in creative mode, Yo, what's up, man? Can I get all the way down to bedrock? Oh, no, no, no. Don't want to do that. Okay, there we go. Slowly and steadily. Down he goes. Down he goes. Just got to make sure I'm dropping at the right time. All right. See you later, buddy. Oh, my gosh. I can break bedrock with this thing. And there goes the creeper. All right. So I'm, I'm sort of kind of stuck down here. Can I use the mine gem for anything? I think the mine gem, I actually need other players, but I can use the space gem in order to teleport. So I should just be able to teleport. Oh, no, yep, right out of here. Can I just, what the? I can activate the ender chest? All right, I just want to teleport to the top. Is that so difficult? Okay, there we go. We are getting close. Here we go, boys. And bam, we're back at the top. So yeah, I just realized if I, okay, let's go back into creative mode. I can just literally open up my ender chest with my reality gem. Now we also have a time gem, which uh, I did want to test something out. Now I'm pretty sure it works on crops, but if I spawn in a pig right here and hit him with the time gem, I can literally turn him from like baby pig all the way to adult pig, back, forth, back, forth. Okay, probably gets a little annoying for you. Sorry, baby piggy. Now we also have a soul gem right here, which uh, yeah, as the name implies, you can just collect up to, I believe like 20 or something souls. And then I can shift right click to uh, place him down wherever I want to. All right, I'm gonna stop messing with you, Mr. Porkers. Let's make you a big pork chop. And let's actually see if I hold down the space gem. Okay, infinite teleportation. Now if I shift with, okay, yeah, I already tested that out. So I think that's pretty much everything. Now it's just, okay, I'm sorry, Miss Pig. I got to do this to you, man. Really, really sorry about this. Bam, get wrecked. What? Whoa, whoa, whoa. How'd you just do that? This pig is now, okay, I think. Okay, I'm sorry about that, Mr. Piggies. But yeah, I think I, I made him super powerful by literally just messing with him over and over again. But yeah, that is the basics of the Infinity Stones. But as you guys probably know, when you combine them all together, it becomes a lot, uh, lot stronger. So yeah, guys, in here, I have the crafting recipe. Now, also, if you're wondering how to get these gems, you can use commands to give them to you, or they'll actually spawn throughout your Minecraft world if you want. So yeah, that's pretty dang cool. But we have to remember this particular order, or else it's going to be a bad day. All right, so we have the mine gem. We have this. And then on the bottom, it's just gold and then the soul gem. So let's go test this out. Let's head and chat and let's see. Come on, boys. Cross your fingers. So these three go up at the top. Then we need a diamond in the center to hold it all together. We got all the different gems. We got the soul gem, some gold ingots. And then, yes, look at that, boys. 
The Infinity Gauntlet. Oh my gosh, this thing is amazing. Oh, oh crap. Okay. All right, guys, it's still flipping amazing. So once you have this bad boy on, first off, it looks absolutely amazing. The 3D model looks awesome. And then uh, it'll start off in the power state, which now is uh, it will basically kill any mob on uh, on contact. Now, also, this acts as a really good pickaxe. It is literally just like creative mode, so you can mine up anything that you want to. And then you can switch which gem is active by pressing C. So let's just say I wanted to teleport around. Boom, we have the space gem, which, okay, how do I? Oh, there we go. So yeah, I can teleport all around the town if I want to. And then also they have different features. So if you hold like right click, it should, oh, where am I going? So I think I used the time gem by accident. Okay, bro, what the heck? So yeah, if you hold down the time gem, it'll randomly teleport you to a brand new dimension. All right, I don't know if I want to be here. But I guess it'll work. So let's uh, let's get the heck out of here. Let's use the time gem again to teleport. Can I just teleport there? Get me the heck out of here. Actually, wait, let's go to the reality gem. And then, yeah, we could just literally make it creative mode. And I think I could also... The reality gem breaks blocks. And then I think also if I hold it down, load it up all the way, it will just start breaking reality. Oh my gosh, this is so weird. Look at that, it is just literally bending all reality. I don't know if this is actually happening or what the heck's going on. It's making love everyone, no, 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 no. Okay, that was bad. Now the only gem I think that doesn't really do anything is the mine gem. I know that it gives you like speed and haste, but other than that, I think it's supposed to be able to collect experience from like other players in your world. But obviously I am, I'm lonely, I don't have any other players. So yeah, I don't have anyone else in here with me. Now we also have the space gem, which up, 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 don't wanna do that. Can I get uh, over there? I just wanna get, okay, there we go. I don't wanna be in the nether anymore. So let's hold down shift and right click and hopefully I go back into my own dimension so I can see like Bessie and the wolf pack, you know. And of course, nope, that is not where we went. Okay, uh, this actually might be okay. So let's uh, get out of here. There we go. I'm actually curious, can I take any damage? So I have like super speed and stuff. Now also if I switch into the power gem mode, hold down shift and right click, should give me some extra power. Wait a second, it's loading up. I don't know what it's loading up. All right, it's taking a, a while to do this. But here we go, boys. Don't know what's gonna happen. Bam. Oh, bro. What did I just do? It attacked everything in this dimension. All right, that was kind of amazing. Now, also, I could just literally right click to do an insta kill. And I think if I hold it down on this guy, hold up. Where is he? Come here, buddy. Bam. Dude, one hit KO'd the flipping Ender Dragon. That's when you know this thing is way too overpowered. Now, Osho, come here, Mr. Endermans. Yeah, there you go, buddy. I'm just gonna collect them up. I can literally just take them around with me if I wanted to. But yeah, I, I kinda sort of wanna get out of this dimension. So let's see, let's use the time gauntlet gem, and then I should just teleport. Oh, never mind, it's the space gem, guys. Don't mind me, I am not the smartest human being. All right, so next up, I should be back in my own world. Um, bro, what? Hold up, hold up, oh, dude. We're in the soul gem dimension? What the heck is this place? Hold on, wait, let's uh, get to the reality gem. Let's go into game mode one. Uh, what the heck? I actually think, wait a second, you can trap players, I know that, with the soul gem. So like when I trap mobs, I guess they're stored in this place, which is kind of weird. Oh my gosh, this thing is just made up of absolute nothingness, except for lava, stone, and then this white stuff. All right, don't want to be in here. How the heck do I get out of here? Space Jam, uh, there we go. Hold it down. Get me the heck out of there. I just want to go see Bessie. So a uh, small, very, very small problem. Uh, I don't know where the flip I am. I'm back in the world, but I don't know like where I'm spawned in. I can't tell, uh, let's see. I'm like right near the world spawn, I'm pretty sure. So how do I get back to Bessie? All right, whatever. We might as well test some other things out. So we have the time gem right here. Does this do anything to plants or anything like that? Hello, plants? Anything? No, nothing crazy. All right, let's get back in survival mode. And I do want to go test out. How do I get to my uh, ender chest? I think it's just which gem? All right, so there we go. We got the space gem right here. So we might as well grab some dinosaurs just to test some stuff out. So we have some velociraptors, some giant piranhas, a tyrannosaurus rex. So let's go see. We have an ankylosaurus right here. Giant dude. Now I wonder, okay, we have the time gem right here. Does this do anything to you? All right, let's load up the time gem, maybe? What the? Yo, where did he just go? 
All right, so I think the time gem, if I remember correctly, if you hold it down like that, it'll teleport any mob back to like the world spawn. Don't really know why. So let's spawn in a Spinosaurus right here. Oh, bro, don't eat me. All right, let's see, which, uh, which gem do I got? Power gem, bam. Okay, that was supposed to work. Hold on, wait, let's load it up. All right, slow and steady wins the race. All right, here we go. We're about to unleash three, two, one, bam. Okay, oh, dude, insta-kill. That is amazing, and I think it killed a bunch of other mobs as well. Sorry about that, Mr. Spinosaurus. We also have a tiny little Velociraptor here. What's up, little dude? So let's test out. I think I can just one-bang him with literally one single... Oh, oh, I feel so bad. So yeah, just literally with the click of a button, I can kill anything in Minecraft. This is basically like the Infinity Attack Damage Sword, except with a giant uh, a gauntlet. And we also... Okay, I just spawned a piranha in the desert. Uh, okay, let's actually collect him. And let's go put him over here in the water. Here you go, little dude. Bam. There you go. Nice and safe and sound. Now, also, guys, another cool thing about the reality gem, once you have it in that mode, any block next to your infinity gauntlet, basically, I believe if you hold down right click, it'll change the surrounding block area into like whatever block is right next to it. So it'll turn this entire area into grass blocks. Now, obviously, that's pretty dang cool if you want to change up like biomes and stuff like that. You could just easily do it, or if you are a savage like me, you can get blocks of diamond and then basically change individual blocks or hold it down all the way, and then bam, we can make infinite diamonds in Minecraft. Now, I think I could also, yeah, I can mine them up too. So basically, once you get uh, the reality gem, you are set for life. Everything you ever wanted, uh, you can obviously get now. So you guys, that is basically everything in this mod. Here we have the uh, Indominus Rex right here. Let's try a space gem on you. No, okay, that didn't work. Time gem? Nope, don't want to teleport you. Power gem? Bam, get wrecked, nerd. All right, let's spawn in a Brachiosaurus. This guy has 120 health. Let's see, let's, uh, wait, can I actually collect him? Dude, that is crazy. Then I can spawn him over here on my diamond collection. What's up, dude? Now, what if I smack you in the face? Does that do, dude, that does a lot of damage. That does, like, at least 20 now, we also have the Reality Gem, which I don't think it does anything to mobs. Let's see. No, nothing to mobs. So this only works on blocks, obviously. Now, we also have the Mind Gem, which steals experience, but doesn't work on giant dinosaurs. It'll work on other players. We have the Space Gem right here. But yeah, I think my favorite is either the Time Gem or, you know, the uh, super awesome, amazing Power Gem. That is a one-hit KO for anything. So you guys, anyway, I think that is going to wrap it up for today's video. If there's any other stuff you want to see with the Infinity Gauntlet in Minecraft, just let me know in the comment section. But anyway, dudes, that is pretty much going to wrap it up. Here is the Infinity Gauntlet in Minecraft. That T-Rex is about to get wrecked in about like 3, 2, 1, bam. Get wrecked, bro. But you guys, anyway, I hope you enjoyed. My name is Beckbro Jack, and I will see you guys all back again here tomorrow. Peace out, dudes.